Song podcast episode eight. You know what it is. Your boy Visionary Mind. It's your boy Ro. Man, we on episode eight already, bro. Hell yeah, yeah. We ain't that yeah. far from ten. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Started a podcast last year. Yeah. You feel me? Now we on episode eight. But hey, last episode and the episodes before, bro. I told you, bro. Like, I only really bring people so far that I fuck with. Yeah, facts. Like, you got to get the fam out of the way. You got to get people that you you rock with. You got to get people that you, you know you rock with their movement, bro. That's real man. shit real shit though you always gotta fuck with the family first man always you feel me um i've been doing our these two guests bro for years yeah yeah like, we grew real up together shit, type shit you know what i'm saying high school together you know, like shit. me for me is before that no oh, yeah, yeah you know what i'm saying family. family for family. sure you feel Daddy, me yeah. already know so you know what i'm saying we do we, we we do the podcast shit bro you know what I'm saying? we fuck with people we only bring people up here we fuck with. We only people are here that, you know, smoke real shit, you know what I'm saying? Got that pack. Facts. You yeah, feel me? You gotta pack, people you gotta fuck with people that's exotic that's, 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 that's that's authentic, bro. And that's they got a move and they got shit going, bro. Like you try a lot of a lot of these podcast niggas, bro, they try to like cloud chase and get, you know what I'm saying, that top nigga and you feel me and and far shorter they go, you feel me? Like you gotta you gotta build a you gotta build a, a foundation. You yeah, gotta get with people man. relationships. You gotta get with people that's you know what I'm saying on your same type of time, you feel me? And and that's growing and building. Yep. Cause right. if you you know you saying you you'll you'll overstep your boundaries a lot of times when you try to, you know, do too much. But like I said, I only you know what I'm saying I've been we've been rocking the eight episodes. Hey, I'm only rocking with people I fuck with, bro. And we got a special guest today. We got two special guests today. Really three. Yeah. Really three. You know what I'm saying? We got two on camera. We got my boy CB, Level Up CB. Yes, well, yes. We got GG Plato and we got GG Flame, bro. What's up, y'all? What's up, yeah. my baby? Nug. You know Man, Nug in the building, man. you feel me? Nug family. Nug family heavy. Nug, nigga. Man, that came in here already with that pack, man. I see the bag already, man. I already know. I know the cuz. This is just a smoke sack, you feel me? You know, this is what we do. You know what I'm saying? Just to get us through. Keep it on the lighter. Facts. So let's let's see a nug lighter. Let's see a nug lighter. Facts. So let's jump straight to it, bro. Introduce ourselves. You know what I'm saying? Let everybody know where they can. Where they could follow y'all at, and you know, what I'm saying, give, give, we're gonna get into for the sure, questions, for but sure, for sure. let them know who, what it is. It's GG played out, man. Old Nug General, you know what I'm saying? Nug family, you know what type I'm shit, man. We in this bitch. So Nug Flame in this motherfucker, man. Y'all Speak up to your mic, hub, uh, B. Say it's Flame in this bitch, nigga. Old Nug, Old Nug Flame, you know what I'm saying? CEO. Hey man, so what's the what's the what's the story behind the name, bro? I mean, cause. It's catchy, bro. Like when y'all y'all got y'all call, y'all say what y'all say, bro. Like, oh no, you record? <laughs> <laughs> How y'all come up with the name? Oh man, I'm gonna start off by letting you know what it really is, man. You feel me? We Gigi. You feel me? First right. and foremost, you feel me? Grand Gang original. You know what I'm saying? Grand Gang. But as we elevated, you know what I'm saying? Became one nation. It's one nation under the ground. You know what I'm sure. saying? We kind of stuck with that. Okay, bitch. Look at that light. <coughs> the nug like damn niggas you bitch choking. Like, damn. Damn niggas fucked up already. <laughs> nug. Nug. Hey, hey, nug. Like, nug. <laughs> but nah, uh how y'all get into this music shit, bro? Shit, man. Just been doing this shit for years since we was kids, yeah. Yeah, So we've been doing this since we was kids. Just the love for the music just kept us going for real. Facts, facts. Just fucking with it, you know what I'm saying? Get in the studio. <coughs> we would do this shit. We was doing this shit on headsets, nigga. I ain't gonna make this shit up, bro. Mm. Fucking with the audacity, nigga. Just wire and around, shit bro. like that. Okay. Just having fun with this shit. Just having fun with this shit. You know what I mean? Facts, facts, facts. So, like, a lot of times, bro, like, with this industry shit, bro, like, a lot of niggas don't move as units. And one thing I like about y'all, though, is that y'all move as a unit. Like, I know that, uh, you are family, but it's deeper than family. Everybody in this family don't move like a unit. How are y'all able to like to to keep that unit part of our child and y'all still adding people, y'all still, you know, uh, you know, moving forward? I mean, 
we blood, so I mean, like, you know what I'm saying? We can't. You know what I'm yeah. saying? First and foremost, but loyalty makes us family. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why we so tired and we like the unity. You know what I'm saying? We move as one. That's just how we been. It wasn't really like a game plan. It's just people who stuck with it, they stuck with it. You know what I'm saying? Loyalty. Yeah. Loyalty, for real. Facts. But no, I'm saying, like, you know, uh, Family is one thing, but y'all move as a unit. You know, fa our family don't move as a unit. You know, like, how are y'all able to maintain that, you know what I'm saying, out here? Shit, we grew up together. Never really separated. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Shit. Shit, what I'm playing, nigga. That nigga won't. Like the ice cream truck stop. He get one. I'm get one. That's how close it is. You know what I'm saying? That's how close it is. Toy Soldiers came out, nigga. Try. Leroy the Gorgon Knights. I got action, nigga. <laughs> 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 Shit like that. Yeah. Yeah, she do. You know, being yeah. family though, that opened up a whole different ball game, especially in the music industry, cause you know a lot of family members don't have the same sound. So y'all, I know y'all got different <coughs> ways. So how that help y'all when y'all doing y'all music? Yeah, I bounce off with his flow, you know what I'm saying? Got more of that. <coughs> Earl, I come in that bitch with the <coughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? You feel me? I come like in that, that bitch with the word play, bro. Come in that bitch and turn it up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And that's really what it be. Spicy nug. Spicy <laughs> nug. <nut. laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. man. My boy Reed is super weapon. Facts, facts. facts. Man, that should be A B stuff. Swag crazy. Swag crazy. Y'all gotta listen to me, bro. I'm gonna tell you. He, he come with the flame, got it, bro. That's the it. Tap, you, tap, you, tap you, on you, you, feel, you feel like that's your like um your personality, or you feel like it's more so like uh like something you had to grow into as an artist. Just me. I'm saying, just me. I got that motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dang. Real or he's smoking niggas. Yeah. Look, man, we've been doing this shit for a while, bro. So, I mean, I can't really sit up here and tell you how we started this shit. You feel me? That shit was, you know what I'm saying? I always like the way myself sound. You dig what I'm saying? So, when I picked up the microphone, man, the first mic I bought was. Fifty dollars, nigga. It was a snowball. No cap. Yeah. <laughs> snowy though. Tell them shit. Let's get the motherfucking car, <laughs> nigga. We drank that bitch <laughs> thirteen hundred yeah. grand, shit, nigga. We cash yeah. for that bitch. Thanks. Back home, um, nigga. We did our thing. Thanks. So. I know that shit sound crazy cause like y'all both love music, y'all both do it. So I know y'all was like, man, hell yeah, bro, get him in that bitch, act a fool, act a fool. I know y'all was on that all no, the time, time, bro. He really drugged me into this shit, bro. You feel me? That's what I'm saying, bro. Fuck with this shit, bro. We'll come upstairs after school and we'll try to piss something together. And the first thing we put together that was lit was this song called Dick Sucker. Oh man, that's <laughs> shit on YouTube. That's shit on YouTube. That's YouTube show, that shit on YouTube. 12, yeah, 13 bro, years. We gotta buy that shit. We gotta buy that shit. Dick Sucker on my dick. That shit was funny as hell. That's Damn. good though. So, how, like, around what age was that though? Like, <coughs> nigga. Nigga, young as hell. 13 at the oldest. Some shit like that. Man. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all been around this shit, y'all seasoned in this shit. Yeah, we've been doing this shit for a minute, bro. Yeah, bro, bro, play is crazy as hell, though. Man, so, what new music y'all been working on? Shit, man, a lot, for real. You feel me? Like I got some shit I've been working on, but lately, we've been working on basically just shit for the Nug family, you feel me? It's all the Nug shit, you feel me? Everybody a part of the organization, everybody part of the family, you know what I'm saying? Who are a part of the family? As far as artists. Well, you know, it's Nug. Oh, Nug. You feel me? Got your boy Spicy Nug, my nigga Flame. Free my baby Warren. Who did it? Shout out Warren. We got 40, we got CB. You already know. Shit, we got Money More, nigga. We got Polo. We got J-Bo. Hey, a lot of us. J-Bo. Everybody 10 years plus, you feel me? Ain't no niggas with J-Bo. Everybody tied in. Yeah, it's really a Nug family. It's really a family, bro. Facts mm. though, y'all definitely man been on each other. For and that. everybody getting yeah. their voice on that wax. Everybody gotta get heard. What you do, this shit and that shit. Yeah, and that's how you handle it. So, what y'all think about dropping an album? Or what y'all gonna drop singles? Like, what y'all doing? Shit, right now we're working on the EP, dudes. You feel me? The seven song EP. You know what I'm saying we gonna drop that. Drop that probably like at the beginning of the year. Beginning of the year. Yeah, but you are gonna see some videos before then. You know what I'm saying? We gonna promote it. Like that. <coughs> 
Facts. So that means y'all working, working. Yeah, we got some shit on the floor. I know y'all. I be hearing some shit, bro. Y'all got some fire ass shit on the floor, for sure. Hey, but look, though, this is most on podcast, right? We don't like the barrage all with questions, man. We like the vibe out to the music. So I got my I got my old nut niggas in here, man. We'll be, oh, we'll, no. Oh, no. We'll, be, we'll be playing first, man. Nah, uh, man, I want to hear some of that shit, dude. Mm-hmm. 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 These niggas swear I keep this shit capping. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, since we're here, bro. That's too near. You got to play that song, bro. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, that one. No, they ain't got to play that one right now, but. They asked some questions on the ground. They asking you real live questions, my guy. Okay, what's the question? Say we got one. She say since since they've been doing this, how long? Who do they draw inspiration from? Yeah, who y'all draw inspiration from? I already know the answer, but hey, shout that person out. Who they? Plus size envy. Oh yeah, shout out envy. She from the uh, North Kakalaki. She part of the podcast. Okay. I just did a lot of inspiration from my pops. You feel me? My pops used to do this shit. You know what I'm saying. Cold with this shit too. Okay. That's where I used to really, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, I pushed him into this shit. I came home every day. He put some shit into the bone box. You feel me? That's what it was. Oh, he to do it. What you find? That's what it is. Shit, man. It was my brother Mud, man. RP Mud, nigga. RP Chuck. Red Mud. Yo, it was Chuck. Red Mud, nigga. Only my baby. He inspired me. Shit. When he used to be freestyling and shit in the kitchen, and he used to go crazy, I ain't go cap. And then it's my nigga play right here. Shit. That nigga was doing the music. Tap me into that line wire. Like I said, that shit to come on. Like, I do not own rights to this music, but I did. <laughs> <laughs> That's how long ago that shit was. Like, yeah. shit. And ever since then, it's been on the phone. So you we gonna go ahead and get into this to this new music or this new music. Okay, let's hear that shit. You already know. This my nigga shit. shit. <laughs> That's some fire for you boys, bro. So look though, so when you uh, coming up with your music, like, um, how do you come up with your like your subject matter? Cause me and uh, Marcus talk about it all the time. Like, what's the oh boy. Thin, what's the thin line between <coughs> uh, <coughs> capping and keeping it real? It's just fucked up for real, for real. So why don't we drop a lot of this shit though? Cause I make music on solely what the fuck going on at the time. 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We make this music, dog. It's all about what's going on at the time. You feel me? Yeah. Which be, which be majority of the reason why a nigga don't want to drop this shit. You feel me? Because a lot of times you feel like you're exposing this. You know what I'm saying? Facts. Especially when you. Yeah, real. I don't be going in the studio trying to make a hit song, bro. I don't even do this shit for no fans, for real. For you feel me? Mm-hmm. This shit is for the nug, nigga. No yeah. okay. Nug. Thanks. Like, I mean, my people ask me to make this shit so they can react to this shit because they don't relate to these other niggas out here. You feel me? Exactly. Like, <coughs> they they like you're authentic. They don't want to know what's really going on. Because they know who he is. So fast. Now, about the team, nigga, the shit we talking about, nigga, they was with me. <coughs> you know what I'm saying? No, that's that's what we're doing. We talking about, bro. You feel me? I do this shit for the family, bro, you feel me? Yeah, but as I've been doing it, my motherfuckers like, man, drop that shit, we fucking want that ass on, man. Mm-hmm. Maybe I need to drop this shit to the world. Man, you definitely do, bro. Yeah, yeah your shit fire as shit. Hey, but, fire as shit. But, 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 but the dig hey. back in that, though, like, what's the what's the thin line between capping and keeping it real? Because it's like, to me, I feel like most mainstream artists and shit like that, like I'm supposed to feel like you a millionaire and you still a slot on a nigga, you feel me? Like it's like, I, it's an entertainment value in it too. It's like, people who rap ain't supposed to be normal people, so it's like, what's the damn line? Shit, bro. Ain't no damn line, niggas. Damn, niggas, it ain't no, bro. Either you being, either you real or you fake, nigga, you know what I'm saying? That's it. Fact. I ain't got nothing against you if you fake, nigga. Just stay the fuck away. You know what I'm saying? That's, 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 that's how you getting your paper, nigga. <laughs> I see it. I can't, you know what I'm saying? I can't like what another nigga doing. You feel what I'm saying? Facts, It's not even really about the, the real action. It's like, the the lifestyle like it, I, the look maybe not so man that's what's a lot going on right now though you feel me a lot of this shit is i feel like it's a culture thing though to be honest know, niggas probably want not really want to see what you was on to be <laughs> being for real they yeah. want to see you do that extra shit they want to see you they want to see you do, do some dumb shit yeah they want to see you really not be you you know what i'm saying so i ain't gonna you feel me that shit honestly that shit paying more than being real you feel me yeah so yeah, I mean, it's, dang, you know what I'm saying? You see why motherfuckers doing it? Yeah. Facts. It is a bag, though. You know, it's a culture thing, though. Like, niggas want to be hood, want to be from the block. Yeah, yeah, the music. Music. For real, for real, these mainstream artists come in this bitch. Real shit. But no, it, it, I feel like you got a lot on in your mind, bro. Like, just tell me how y'all think about the music industry. Because a lot of this shit is for the ground. It's, it's, it's shit we see every day. Like, I, I, I really want to know your opinion about it. Like, this music shit, cause it like this y'all life too. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Y'all, yeah, y'all, yeah. y'all, y'all trying to get to a certain point too. So it's like ain't about fitting in, but like how y'all feel about it though? Like shit, crazy right now. It's like there's a lot of good shit going on. It's a lot of bad shit going on. You know, niggas dying. Like shit. That's anyway though. That's, that's what I'm about to say. Yeah, when I'm talking about when it comes to like this music shit as a whole, like. What y'all think of like the state of it, or like, oh yeah, yeah I see like Detroit saying. culture, or even, I, even 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 you know just in general. I don't really be thinking about that shit for real. When I be making music, I go on that bitch and I just <coughs> say what I feel for real. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> if they don't like it, fuck them. I'm making music for myself and the people around me that I love and the people that's gonna fuck with me. You feel me? Facts. Facts. I don't make it for no industry niggas, but take me as I am, nigga. You feel me? It's who I is. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Look. Shit. Yeah. 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 But I'm saying, like, how y'all feel about the, the the music shit, though? Like, y'all 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 artists that make music. So I'm saying, like, how y'all feel about it? Like, how y'all like navigating through it? Like, or do y'all listen to it? Do y'all think it? Like, y'all see, that's it right there. I was thinking in my head, like, I'm gonna answer the question. I don't even be listening to this right there, bro. I be listening to the nugget, bro. You yeah. feel me? So I can't really tell you. Motivate your own. But other people be doing it, you feel me? That's, that's, that's where the ears at. Like, bro. I don't, be, mm-hmm. I don't be glimpsing across the blogs and shit. I be seeing what going on, but video. a lot of that shit be... A lot of comical shit I be seeing going on, you feel me? Yeah, real shit. I be like, this shit for sure ain't really my life. But do you feel like that's necessary to the, to the appeal, though? Because you want to do shows, you want to make money, you want to move around. Right? No. See, that ain't... No, you don't shift. I mean... If you that type of person, I guess you do what works for you, you feel me? Right. But the, I came on, you know what I'm saying? I was all right, bro. You stick to it, you feel me? Right. You be consistent. Yep. That shit paying off for you. You know what I'm saying? All right. Ain't about switching up. Yeah, no, you stay the same. Because whether the same. you go... <coughs> see, it's all about what your goal is, you feel me? Maybe a nigga want to be like Drake. I don't know. 
And maybe a nigga just wanna get that pack, you feel me? See, I just wanna get the money. I'm saying, so I ain't tripping, but I ain't trying to be the biggest. That's a good ass blue right there. Situation type shit. You know what I'm saying? Situation type shit. On the nut. Nut fucking up. Because a lot of that shit comes with selling your soul, bro, in my opinion. You feel me? Talk about it. You gotta do some bogus ass shit to be like that. You feel me? And I ain't really trying to be in those type of situations. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? I'm that ain't gonna work in my favor. You feel me? Facts. I'm gonna just get my piece of the pad, nigga, and ride it on out. You feel me? Me and mine's gonna get off that shit. We're gonna keep maneuvering through that shit. You feel me? Real shit, though. Yeah, yeah. I ain't really. You feel me? Trying to take it off, nigga, but we gonna get it for sure. We gonna eat. Mm-hmm. We ain't gonna be the last nigga on the totem pole. I'll tell you that right now. For sure. For sure. For sure. You feel me? You already know, though. That's real shit, though. But as I say always, bro, all that shit come out to the light in the, in the long run, though. Real shit. You know, but if you doing what you supposed to do, handling your business, bro, y'all gonna make it no matter what. Real shit. And hey, what was the uh, inspiration? Yeah, stick to this shit. Man. Hey, it's consistency. Is, man. Yeah. Consistency. What was the mindset on that last song you played? Cause that shit fire, bro. And I saw a lot of, uh, heard a lot of Cali references and like. Oh, that's like the second home, man. I love Cali dudes. You feel me? Cali is I'm like the second home. I got a lot of people out there. L.A. the Bay, where at? What up, L.A.? I like LA, you feel me? Mm-hmm. But the Bay cool right. too. I got family in the Bay. I heard the Bay like I heard the Bay like the city. Yeah, it's like the city, you feel me? You broke into the Bay, I ain't touching the Bay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But I'm on my way. I LA with the Bay. Like, I can see why they say it's like the city. But if you ask me, my ain't, ain't nowhere like my city. You know, nowhere like the city. Like Speaking of that, bro, you know yeah. we just had BMF come out. We had a whole bunch of like you know what I'm saying different shit from our culture. Like, what you feel about niggas not from Detroit trying to steal? That's cool, bro. Yeah, you want to get a bike? Yeah, you feel yeah. me? That's what they gonna do. That's what's gonna yeah, make this shit spread. Some niggas really? feel like shit. Niggas need to pass for that type of shit. They better make it sound good. You make that shit sound yeah. trash. I ain't even. I ain't even talking about the music. I'm just talking about the general. Like niggas wearing Cardi or Zay, where like niggas. Do you? Yeah. DJ Kelly got some Cardi. <laughs> do them. You know what I'm saying? Appreciate yeah. you. Know what I'm saying? I show you where that shit really came from. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They are. Say when you see the buffs, you think about Detroit. That's the first thing you think about. Motor yeah. City. Say he got tired. Where he gotta be somewhere. With to me, I feel like when people like try to do that shit, it kind of overshadow the city, though. What do you mean? Like, you know, niggas like niggas start to think that come from different places. Like, it's like that a lot of times with Detroit and Atlanta. Like a lot of Atlanta culture is Detroit shit. Nah, people, they know where that shit came from. <laughs> You'd be surprised. Say, oh, yeah. You'd be surprised. <laughs> When I feel like my first song all the time. They ask you like, "Where y'all from?" First thing they ask you, and the first thing they looking for is, "I'm from Detroit." Right. You know what I'm saying? Fact. Now, if you got some wires on, then it's questionable. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that nigga probably from Atlanta or something yeah, like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You never know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Man, I think it's about time to get into another song, bro. I want to hear some more fire. Yeah, yeah, bro. Drop some, some more of that shit. Uh, oh, you already know Nud Family. Let's just smoke some podcast. Really, we like to smoke some more. You already know. Turn it up as much as you need. Crunchy, crunchy, crunchy. This is real crisp. Ooh, what the fuck is that? Don't sweat the blast and shit. Get my ear. That's on my mama, nigga. But I need to be on the Fuck, where you from? Yeah, what it on my cup? 
<laughs> no, I'm telling you, he be like, hey, bro, one. tell that nigga send me that. Man. Tell that nigga to send me that. Yeah. Yeah. No, he be on that. Put that shit on that cup, man.